Hello everyone, Xenia and Zimmer here. Welcome back to Let's Play Fire Emblem Free Houses. Part 2. Verdant Wind. Great Tree Moon. Blood of the Eagle and Lion. Now in control of the Great Bridge of Murden, the Alliance Army invades the Imperial territories. In response, the Imperial Army garrisons soldiers at Fort Mercius. Come on, load so we can get to get seen. Paralogue. All of that went about as well as it could have. Each lord has agreed to provide us with soldiers and supplies. I'm impressed you were able to convince all of those scattered nobles to help us. I thought they would quarrel about how much support they should each provide. That's what they usually do. Well, Count Gloucester took the initiative in taking on responsibilities. I presume that was because you spoke with him in advance, Lawrence. I merely explained the situation at hand. And my father simply followed your lead, Claude. It was because you had the professor there to represent Lady Rhea. My father is a pious follower of the Church of Seros. <laughs> I don't doubt it. I wasn't under the delusion that it was my personal charm that unified everyone. Thanks for that, by the way. I hope you don't feel like I used you, because I sort of used you. Don't mention it. I appreciate that. We don't have time to be picky about our methods. But be honest, you're having a hard time adjusting to your new role, aren't you? You weren't even a follower of Seros to begin with, and somehow you've ended up as a representative of the church. I realize that you might feel guilty about deceiving the believers for our cause, but this is just what the Archbishop wanted, and she's the highest authority in the church. Besides, as wielder of the sword of the Creator, it's undeniable that you're special. I think you should be more confident in yourself and use your position to the fullest. I have news. Our enemy is gathering troops at Fort Mercius. Their army is immense, likely led by a renowned general, or perhaps even... Ilgard? Well now, that would be interesting. If we can defeat the Emperor, then the Empire will collapse. There's something else. An unidentified army has approached the Great Bridge of Murden. They passed through the Daphnil and Gloucester territories from the northwest with incredible speed. They're raising the banner of House Blathed. Perhaps they are the remnants of the Fargus royal family. From what we could tell, they posed no threat to the citizens of the Alliance, and so we refrain from engaging them in needless combat. Maybe they hope to fight against the Empire to avenge their fallen prince. And what about the bridge itself? Obviously, we wouldn't let them pass without receiving envoys first. We thought they may try to force their way through. We considered firing warning arrows, but they left immediately, heading east. Are they intending to use one of the bridges in Ordelia territory? Most likely. But the Imperial Army still controls those bridges. I can't imagine what they intend to do in the Empire, even if they do manage to break through. I'm reluctant to ease up on our surveillance, but it would be difficult to track them there. For now, let's assume they're just troops belonging to the Old Kingdom. In any case, we should proceed with caution. Soon we'll be entering Empire territory ourselves. If our enemies are going to intercept us with an attack, it will probably be at Grander Field. How fitting that it was the site of the Battle of the Eagle and Lion five years ago. And, yep, that's our destination. But it isn't our only thing. Ow! Oh! He has accepted the Silk Dragon Armor. I've still got some hidden potential. Now, Claude might as well be, be invincible. Not joking. The Sleeping Sand Legend is now available. We'll get to that soon. Well, 
It's like this. Pardon me. Hilda? Claude reminds me of the back when it was and then we have Excuse me. Could you do me a favor? Thanks so much. You're a sweetheart. Oh. There we go. Hey, I could use a hand. Really, there's a I hope this. Hey, how about a favor? Thanks. I'm glad I asked you. <sighs> Go over here. Let's see if we have need something. This one? You're all set. See you again soon. Now, let us eat food. If someday our positions change, we will not have many opportunities to eat together like this. True, that would make this moment a priceless memory. <laughs> nah, just kidding. Let's just eat a... Nice. This eating. Do it this way. That uh, this Barabosa. That's not good. Thanks. <sighs> Can't stay longer. Hilda. Just 
Risk it. Sorry, Marianne. If I'm right. There we go. Now we can switch up. The six. Okay, then we don't need. Why sip yet? Instruct manually. Book grip plus four, plus ten, not plus five. I learned a. Let's do this. Beery. I'm back. Sorry about that. Plus, can't really do much about this. Same with this. 
Axe and flying. Okay, begin training. A question. As good a reason as any. And no experience for Professor level because we're maxed out. I'm will not can argue. Perfect. Feeling pretty good at Okay, let's go. Nothing like it. There is no need to rush. Maxed. Good. That smell. This. Leave. Okay, now let's move to try and finish the sauna. Make it sound like I'm saying, <sighs> so. and Marianne are here. Professor, I trust if we lose if that happens, my parents won't escape unharmed. They've raised their anti-imperial flag after all. 
Thank you, Professor. Speaking with you has eaten. Something's going on with that brilliant mastermind's mind. Hmm. Huh? Um, apparently his country was... We'll then take some flying lessons from everyone. I hear that I missed, but on the best. This will end today's free time. Yeah. Instruct. Teach. That's what I say. <laughs> I look I've that nice. This should be should be okay. It was yes. now it was we have the magic yeah. nuke herself. Why is it here? I got Hmm. I've Nope. <laughs> nope. I've learned. Let's rush in for everything we got. That was so helpful. Flying only. You should get to you until you get an S. Same with you. Yep, everyone else. Uh... Nice. Uh, before I forget, Italians. Trade. Then feed them. Feed. Them food. Uh, 
No. Okay, so... Mario and Ignace. I like this dish. It was my father's favorite. Uh, this... There we go. This too. Hey. That smell. This is up. Sport. Okay, so it's only a scratch, Leone. One mistake like that in battle, and you're done. Apologies. No trouble, and no apologies. <sighs> Darn. What's wrong? I need a bandage to st my handkerchief. I was only carrying it around to give back to you. Very well. <laughs> I guess I'm glad you'll accept it, though. Yes, I might have made it an issue of commoners giving. I didn't understand why you were so strict. Of, you know, if every noble were like. Perhaps, but you were right. Right, I forgot. I forgot what to skip. Street. Okay. Hey. Now these two. Oh, it's ah. Yes. We... Now I can start bonding those two together. Professor, speaking. I'm getting the. I'm getting the hang of it. Huh? Um, I heard that some unidentified apparent is country. Not in talent. All you what magic avoid? It's good. Uh, where is Claude? Oh, Claude's up here. Could I trouble you? Each time I search if I'm right. Flying. What? What? Hey. What? What? I hear I missed it on the back. Nice. Hey there. We see the empire. I'm not. It's my with your pal. I don't know if this got better flying than me. I know someone else does, but I don't know if it's Hilda or no. If it is, uh, door. Claude would remind when it was then, then we. Nope, it's not you. It's not Ignaz. Maybe it's Lawrence. There's someone else at level A. There's something house glow, but thank ordinary, but it is we are in the Actually, no Cyril.
Marker here. Oh, there. No, we might get there. And those. Not sure how we're supposed to. Anyway. Nope. It's not Leone. <clears throat> I'll check Flame and Ignaz. Can you recall whether it was before or after I joined your class, Professor? I'm glad you- It was short- I'm not even going to- <sighs> Hilda! But it's you or me. Yeah. Oh. Sorry, but it's you or me. You are me. And finals. Clearly, we're gonna withdraw. Oh my god, Sorry, but it's off. Check something. Oh my god, Claude. God. Ignatz. I, I've re no. Maybe. No. Nope. God, we're not even getting any perfects. Help. Ah, painful. Can't argue with results, can't? I still have much. You know what? Uh, I'll give you guys a little extra in this episode. 
So I'm going to tell you how I'm going to handle this. We're going to be doing Sleeping Silent Legend this episode. And off screen, I'll be doing Battle at Grander Field, which is funny because of war at Grander Field and Battle in the Plains. So, let's go. Sleeping in the sand. Hmm. Very interesting. What's interesting? Oh, Teach. How long have you been there? Don't sneak up on me like that. You almost gave me a heart attack. Anyway, I'm reading the official biography of the Four Saints, as sanctioned by the Church. I know you're not very familiar with the teachings of Seros, but even you must have read it at least once. Hey, B? Huh. I'm amazed you managed to get a job teaching at an academy run by the church. Well, whether you've read the biography or not, the Four Saints must at least ring a bell, right? Well then, I've got a little quiz for you. Name the Four Saints, companions of the great Saint Seros. I'll give you a hint. There was Keyhole, Sepleen, Indec, and... Who was the fourth one again? Matthew. Correct. I was hoping you'd know that much, at least. In any case, you can learn some interesting things reading about the life and times of Saint Macuil. For instance, he was more skilled with his hands than his fellow saints, and even became an accomplished blacksmith. He used his skills to forge countless sacred weapons for the army of Seros. Of course, he didn't just forge the weapons, he also used them in battle himself. Legends say his strength was second only to Seros. It's even said that he played a big role in the Battle of Teltine, where Seros fought Nemesis, the King of Liberation, who became the King of Evil. Machuel lost his life in that battle, and now his body rests in a coffin within the Holy Mausoleum. Or so one story goes. Another legend says he set off on a journey to find a new land, that he left Fodlan from the east, crossed the sea, and vanished. He must have left Alliance territory, but where exactly would he have set sail from, I wonder? Thinking about it reminds me of another interesting story concerning the Strang region. The peninsula is attached to the mainland of Fodlan and extends from the northeastern part of Kingdom territory. If you were to set sail from Margrave Edmund's territory, you could cut across a stretch of sea and land there. And it just so happens that in the Srang region, there are ruins built to worship a sacred beast that appeared from across the sea. If the ruins have something to do with St. Machuel, there could be sacred weapons there. So, have I piqued your interest or what? Maybe a little. You always have to play it cool, don't you? Just think of how useful it would be to have weapons like that. Not to mention that the peninsula would be pretty easy to get to about now, seeing as how Alliance territory has settled down a bit. Yeah. We'd be there and back in no time. No one would even notice we were gone. Come on, Teach. Let's go to the Srang region. Let's go. I always see it through once I set my mind on something. Let's make the necessary preparations before I die of curiosity. <laughs> so... Before the update, this would be the final paralogue grateful. of just a pure Golden Eagle run. Golden I Eagle. Have gratitude. Golden Deer. <laughs> I've been playing a different game. So Actually, it only has a Golden Eagle as <laughs> one of the characters. So, yeah, we're facing phantoms. I guess you could say, we'll never see it coming. No, I'm not apologizing for that. If we can get that killer bow, that would be great. Pure water, rusted lance. Silver sword. And that is all the enemies. Oh, oh, there's that tomahawk. But this is the more interesting one. The wind call. Children of the goddess. Lord of desert. Creston of Machiel. He has Gale. And he's pretty big! Pretty big! Uh, 
Okay. So. Uh, problem is, I want to max out this before we can move on. So I'm gonna be weakening Claude for a My bit. Next steps are clear. Okay. So. Right. Units. Remove Anna. No, it sounds crazy. But it's better this way. Okay. Let's go. Launching. There are the ruins. It looks like we're not going to have the luxury of an excavation. Look, I bet those are the watchmen of the ruins, and that they've been ordered to keep out intruders. And that big beast? I hear they call it the Wind Caller. Please. Only by defeating me can you claim the secret treasure. Yeah, it speaks. What is it? The root. Huh? Who are you? I'm just here for a bit of treasure. Don't attack me. Someone got here first. Must be a band of looters. We can't let them get the treasure. Guess their luck's about to run out. Okay. Let's make now, quick. let's start with a little bit of warping. Okay, move back a bit. My orders? Point blank volley. You're not trying to take this treasure from me, are you? Yes, I am. Self-killed. Still axe is gone. Back to the combo. Do my best. What's my strategy? Okay, so from map fan. Onward. Steady now. End. Guide me well. Just use it. Okay. Shall we? Now the rest of us. Dismount. Leave it to me. Dismount. Shall we? Dismount. Short spear. Uh. 
giant crawler. Just gonna just try and pass them. Get this treasure. Huh? They're going to be wasting that killer bow, so we need to be quick. Okay. Quick. I've got no time for mercy. Onward. Shall we? Leave it to me. Sorry, it's gotta be like this. Tom Hawk. Our quarrel wasn't personal. No more magic. No more. My orders? Guide me well. Sure, Spear. You shall not survive! Jesus. I won't allow it. You did it. Still, good job, Sav. Steady now. Combat arts. I took care of it. At the ready. What's 
my strategy. Uh, first, equip Nosferatu. Second, heal. We're not fighting. Really, zero damage. Shall we? Yeah. Let's think about this. Shall we? Really? Leave it to me. Okay. Get out of here. Sure. There we oh. go. <laughs> My orders. Goodbye, giant crawler. Number one. There's not really much point trying to keep them alive. Because I'll be real. They're annoying. You better not. He died. We lost that. No. <sighs> Strategy in motion. I fought and Are you trying to murder them, Claude? Well clearly the answer is yes. Sand crawlers. All I can think is Star Wars when hearing sand crawler. At the ready. Dismount. And you literally cannot do anything. Steady now. After all the trouble we went. I can do this! <gasps> Goodbye! Future of Pure water! What's my strategy? Just enough. Allow me to demonstrate! <laughs> it won't be in vain. There is still room for improvement. Let's be 
prudent. Guide me well. Just the hindrance, that is all. Haven't with the this just as expected. Thanks. I'll do my best. Heal. Must lead them well. I took care of it. Nice. Perfect. Perfect. Miasma. I've got no time for trying. Sportify. Salt of the lifetime. Giant sand crawler. outcome. It's a bad time to die. At the ready. Guide me well. Judgment is passed. Lament your weakness. Jesus. Ah, you did it. Monster blast. My moment has arrived. There we go. You got yourself killed. What's my strategy?
steady now. Let me paint you a picture. There we go. Still alive. Just like that. Okay. Now everyone is practically in position, except for flying. Let's be prudent. Let's make this quick. Okay. What would I do? Now let's enter and start the first phase. Okay, there we go. Put it in the center. I smell those detestable ten elites. Who are you? I'm the grandson of the grandson of the grandson of the elite Regan. Now tell me who you are. I am your family's enemy. If you carry the blood of the Ten Elites, you cannot be permitted to live. What do you mean by that? And what's that crest on your forehead? No more talk. If you wish to survive, you must destroy me. Good time for a secret skin. The wing color has got... Has his attention? Grabbed. Uh, which one does. Yes, yeah, Sarah's. Orders? You have had your fun. If you are going to flee, now is your chance. If you are not going to flee, I shall take your life as payment. Can we help? I've got another option. That is a fitting line. Gambit. Hmm. Those who stand before me, how long has it been? Hundreds of years, thousands. You have the stink of Sothis upon you. Let us find out whether you share her power. Let us know. It's time. Seraph, who has interesting dialogue. Are these your companions? They are indeed. I should tell you that Seros is in a precarious state right now. I will not assist you. I have lived apart from the world of man, which disgusts me so. This war disgusts me also. I thought you might say as much. That is regrettable. to the wing callers. Attention! Onward! Oof. That's gonna hurt a bit too much. Not, not exactly a fan of that. Shall we? Wonder why I'm a fan of them. Nope, nope, nope. Shatter. Will not fall. We're back. Cut and gale. Uh, yeah, cut and gale. Oh, that face takes me back in time. You have not changed one bit, Seth. I ask that you keep quiet, Uncle. Why the rush, Seth? Shh. Please keep quiet, Uncle. <laughs> And reveal. Not really hidden, though. A bit disappointing. 
Okay. Uh. Yeah. Nosferatu, Aura, 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 Aura. I'm sorry. Oh my God! And the wind color is still stunned. I want to. Okay. Kill the bow. I can do this. Hit Crickle. Uh, Leave it to me. Shall we? Uh, a light little tap. Okay, no, maybe not. Maybe I have to get a bit closer. Sephirim? Oh, Sephirim. Nope. It will just kill. Or not. I forgot you had one more health bar. means more strength yeah. it stopped moving is it dead nope no it seems it's just sleeping I thought we were supposed to be given the treasure but uh, forget it I'll just have a look around there what about this thing huh. I'll think about it later sleeping sand Legend. Oh, the time. Mm. We'll see the ending of this par paralogue next time. I guess we will be showing, showing training. This is Zeno Zua. Sign out. <laughs>